guys, this is Versatile from VST Power, hosted on the Money of Phoenix channel. In today's video tutorial, I'll show you how simple it is to play NES ROMs online using Nestopia. So, first thing is you need to download the emulator. So go to nestopia.sourceforge.net. In the more info section, I got the links. Basically, go to the download section, download the latest version, which is version 1.40. Download and extract it. Likewise, we need to get the latest version of the Calera client .dll. Download it and extract it into your main folder where nestopia.exe is and also go ahead and while you're at it make a ROMs folder and go ahead and put your designated Nintendo ROMs whatever games you want to play that has two players I'm not gonna tell you where to get the get the ROMs I know you can use Google and go ahead and find what you need so next thing you want to do is let's double click nestopia and I'm gonna assume that you already configured your inputs and you already configured your joysticks for player one and player two accordingly okay so what we're going to do is go to Netplay, go to Connect, go ahead and add a game. So let's pretend that game that was not there in the beginning. So I go to Add, I go to my ROMs folder, and I go ahead and select my game. Now I highlight it, click on Launch, and now you have this new window here basically. Here you set your, your name, here you set your connection, so I usually set as good. And then your change mode is client. Originally, you won't have this galaxy here. So what you do is you go to the master service list, do refresh, and go ahead and find a server which has the lowest ping to your computer. I just happen to be that the galaxy was the closest one to where I am living right now. So I use that particular location, which is a really good place. So let me go ahead and go to the galaxy. Now, I did this very similarly on my laptop. So my laptop is currently just waiting here inside the galaxy lobby so if you have a friend tell them go to the galaxy or go to whatever server uh, you told them to go to now what you want to do is go down here right click and say uh, create and then go ahead and select whatever games you have in your list I only have one game right now so I'm gonna create a lobby for this Ninja Turtles right now the laptop what he needs to do is basically go down into the list find the game double click on it and here he is in my little lobby I click on start and now it begins Sweet. And then if you want to adjust the window, you know, the, you can do that as well. I'm going to press my start button here. Select the mode. I uh, have the laptop. Select a, uh, a character as well. Now, it's, it's important if your other friend is connected that they select the correct, you know, gamepad over here as well. Okay, so let's go back to uh, the game here. And we can clearly see that the game is working out fine. So here's the laptop, Ra Fia oops, Raphael running around. And here I am, Leonardo. So that's pretty much the tutorial in a nutshell. Let me leave this game right now. So if you have any nitpicky questions, go ahead and leave a comment here on the YouTube page. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.